Hi, my name is Jackie Kai Ellis, and I'm going to be talking about a fashion inspired table today. About two weeks ago, I went to Toronto uh, and created a fashion inspired brunch at Toronto Fashion Week. They asked me to create sort of mood boards and, and fashion inspiration from spring summer um, fashion collection and create a table that was inspired by what I saw. I got inspiration from the spring summer collection of Valentino, about rich florals, rich color, uh, lots of textures. So I decided to take uh, that one inspiration of the florals and the, the color palette and translate it into a table that we could potentially do in our own homes. These flowers are, are definitely the centerpiece. These are done by a garden party flowers in Vancouver and what we've done is just created lots of different textures, lots of different heights in the in the floral arrangements. I tried to keep it as wild and organic and um, like a Dutch Flemish sort of color palette feel to it and then I uh, woven in other sort of fashion inspired detail. For example, these plates here uh, are actually the newest collection of Hermes and they've taken inspiration from the textiles. These plates here, uh, which are Renault and I guess the wife of the owner is a shoe designer and she actually designed this collection. And we have the cutlery as well, bringing in some different brass colors and darker sort of tarnished brass colors. And these are from Saint Bonnet. You can find these all at Atkinson's in Vancouver as well. So Kim Crawford Wine has beautiful uh, sort of citrus notes like pink grapefruit, um, lots of passion fruit. Uh, what I decided to do was sprinkle the entire table with lots of different types of citrus. I got this idea of doing a cloche actually from wine touring in Bone, France. They would do these cloches and inside the cloches would be all the different uh, fruits and even tobacco and leather that you might find in a particular bottle of wine. And when you actually lifted the cloche up, you get to smell basically all the aromatics. And it's a great talking uh, point for your guests and something interactive for them to do. These wine gems uh, from Rab Labs, you put them into your freezer and they get cold and they work very much like whiskey rocks and they keep your Sauvignon Blanc or your whites chilled for just a little bit longer. So I decided to choose linens that were just a little bit deeper, a little bit, um, not that pure white linen, but just something just a little bit different in sort of a cream, natural, rustic sort of feel to it, um, just to create a little bit more depth. When you're entertaining and people are sitting down uh, to eat, it's a very tactile, sensual experience. And so you definitely want to create a lot of different textures and whether it's in the florals or in everything that they touch. So the cutlery feels smooth and the linens might feel a little bit rougher. We decided to pair it with um, a napkin linen that is the same color, but slightly different texture. So again, you get texture on texture and you're sort of layering those elements together. We found one with a slight gold fleck to it, which then ties in all the different types of metallics that we have on the table as well. So for the cutlery, we actually chose a very modern silhouette, but in different metals, tarnished brass C color is a true gold brass color. And I really like the idea that you can mix metals together. I've even uh, done mixing silvers and golds together. 